Today for autumn preserve making we're going to make bramble and bramley apple curd and for this we need 225 grams or half a pound of brambles or you might call them blackberries 225 grams or a half a pound of peeled cord and chopped bramley apple and that's the prepared weight one lemon 225 grams or half a pound of castor sugar, two eggs beaten and 57 grams or approximately two ounces of butter and it's to be preferably unsalted butter. As you can see in the pan we have the prepared chopped up apple and the brambles and approximately a tablespoonful of water and what we're going to do that uh, is cook the apples, cook the brambles until it reaches a pulp but before we do that we're going to add the grated rind of the lemon as you can see the apples and the brambles are brambles as we call them in Scotland but you call them blackberries too are pulping down quite nicely and we've got this lovely sort of autumnal colour and the smell is lovely appley and brambly. After it's all pulped down we're going to sieve this and I'll show you how to do that in a few seconds. As you can see the mixture is in the sieve and we're gently going to push that through so that it goes into the bowl and that is to get rid of any apple skin or any bits of hard bits of apple and uh, also the pips or seeds from the brambles. As you can see I've successfully pulped the mixture through the sieve and it's in the bowl and we're left with just a little bit of apple and seeds. And at this stage, you will probably have to take a spoon, make sure it's cleanish, and scrape the sieve like that to get all the pulp into the bowl. Next, we're going to place the bowl over a pan of simmering hot water but making sure that the bowl does not touch the hot water that is important and then to the bowl we're going to add the lemon juice and the castor sugar and we're going to make sure that that is completely dissolved As you can see the mixture has gone quite runny now but don't panic that's how it should be and then you're going to add your two beaten eggs make sure that they are well beaten and there's no bits of white showing and then to that we're going to add that to the pan Give it a good stir around. And then we're going to add the butter. And then we're just going to slowly cook that over the water until it's thick. And that can take anything from about 15 to 20 minutes to cook. And that's how quick and simple it is to make blackberry or brambles as we call it in Scotland curd. As you can see the curd is now cooked and it's fairly thickish consistency and it takes about maybe 20 to 30 minutes to reach this point. And as you're cooking it, you can have your tray with your selection of jars that you're going to use heating up in the oven, ready for potting up the curd. And that's what we're going to do now. You just take a ladle full and put it into your sterilised jar.
Your curd will keep for about six weeks in the fridge. You must keep it in the fridge.